welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Hadra I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe down below and yeah hit the bell button so you get notified every time I upload I upload twice a week every week so make sure you hit that subscribe button so today we're going to be talking about habits that we can start implementing in 2020 to reach our goals so as most of you know it's the new year is like right around the corner and yeah i'm sure a lot of you guys have new year resolutions including myself if you guys want to know what my new year resolutions are comment down below and i might just reply to you and tell you what they are but just to get into but now everyone has a goal now how can we achieve the goal that's what i'm trying to get at so i've been like researching and like looking and like you know ha how to like acquire the goals that we're setting so i came up with 10 habits they look over 10 but let's just say 10 10 habits that we can implement to reach our goals in 2020 so the first goal which is create a routine so like it's very our, our body adapt to like how whatever we do frequently our body adapts to that adopts to that am i saying it correctly i hope i'm saying it correctly they our body like gets used to like a specific routine especially like a morning routine is very important and um i honestly couldn't i haven't i don't know how to say this i am really bad at morning routines but i've been trying to like wake up at a certain time and like you need to plan out your day so um, I've been trying to like wake up at a certain time every day okay guys so yeah the first thing is implementing a routine um, the second thing is get ready right away so when you're when you wake up like get ready right away like don't don't linger around and waiting for i don't know like stand up in your pjs and go make food and like stuff like that like don't stay with like your pjs too long because that is the start of a lazy day like if you if you don't get ready up I, I find that if you don't get ready right away your day is just gonna be lazy throughout I don't know why but I think I think it has something something to do with like your mood or something but yeah so just try <laughs> try to get ready right away as soon as you wake up um, also make your bed like I, I suck at this but in the morning when you wake up just make your bed it, it actually I don't know why like I find that the days that I make my bed right away I'm more productive than the days that my bed is not made I don't know why but it's just it's just a fact <laughs> okay next thing is start saying no so start saying no to things that you really don't want to do so if like some someone is coming and telling you oh let's go do this let's go do that and you know you're gonna be like uncomfortable in that situation or you don't really want to do that thing just do your best to say no. It's okay if you say no. That person will understand. Just as it's better than just going there and you being miserable in that situation. Well, you could have just said no. Um, next thing is cut out bad friends. Um, so the people you surround yourself with, like that statement that says, "Show me your five, the five your five closest friends and I'll tell you who you are actually it actually does mean something like the people you surround yourself with are gonna influence you whether you want them to or not so yeah it's just I feel like it's a good thing to like detox from all those bad negativity the negative stuff and everything so yeah so cut off all bad friends of like things that people who are not aligned with the goals you want to meet because you know you know you want to reach uh, to a certain level and if you're hanging out with someone who's below here like they're not gonna help you to reach there get it so yeah so yeah cut off the bad friends and I'm not saying this like don't care about them or whatever just and don't be like oh you're too low for me or you're too un whatever for me no I don't mean it that way I just mean like 
just stop hanging out with them as much because you know where you want to reach in life you know um be mindful of who you give your time to okay this aligns with like the bad friends thing so like if you're just be mindful of the person you're giving your time to and your energy to and if they like benefit their benefit in your life um the next thing i had was is um have a specific goal like have a goal in the farthest future like right now we have like monthly goals weekly go like weekly goals monthly goals goals like yearly goals like our goals for 2020 but also in your head you should have that mindset of like your ultimate goal like the thing that you're as aspiring to achieve like the end goal so every time in your head you think of that image and you should have like an image of it in your head so you're like that is what i want like that will be your drive to go through whatever you're going through because you want to reach to that certain goal and it doesn't have to be like oh i want to give my uh what is it 4.0 gpa on my sats which i do want to do that but um yeah it doesn't have to be like a really really hard goal it can be just like a nice just like a nice goal that motivates you to wake up in the morning okay so next is figure out what you're good at and what you're really bad at so like um figure out what you're really bad at and like when someone offers you oh guys let's go do this you'll be like nah i i, I don't want to do that i'm not i'm not good at that like you can find someone else who's good at that then figure out what you're what, what you're bad at and say no to that then figure out what you're good at then um improve yourself in that aspect like if you know you're good at like drawing go and draw more and like become better at that if you're good in photography take more pictures like take pictures of like improve your skill whatever skill you have improve in it because it and if you really like that and imagine you can turn that into your job and like your job being something that you love is like a goal that we all have i think because it's good to like you live a happier life if you love your work so if you're really good at something and you enjoy that and that turns out to be your work you're gonna be living like you're gonna be looking forward to your days working yep next is um say yes to things that you're scared of or that make you nervous you know like when someone tells you oh let's go like go and give a speech me um go and give a speech and you become so nervous and like you're like oh my god like you want to do it but you're scared like that means you care like when you're when you're nervous to do something that means that you care about that thing like you care about the outcome about that thing so just yeah be say yes to the things there's the good kind of nervous scared and the bad kind of being scared so like the, if it gives you that you know woo, feeling that oh my god i'm scared about this blah blah blah, blah like do it like yeah um next thing is um wake up early waking up early is like a key to acquire achieving your goal like um imagine a person who wakes up at noon and a person who wakes up at eight the time difference like that other person like when you're waking up at noon the person who woke up at eight already like ha has gone through like almost half of their day already and you're just waking up when people have already like started grinding and like hustling and whatever and like reaching their goals and stuff so just try waking up early because it it will benefit you and you have way more time to work and like achieve your goals and be more successful like no billionaire sleeps till noon like they are all up now think if that person's a billionaire and he's up by six why should i be in bed well i need to like to get to that place meaning i need to be working harder to achieve to get to where that person is but that person is like working 10 times more hard efficiently and also don't 
work hard, work smart. Like, I'm sure all of you have heard that statement. Like, let's say, try making passive income. Okay, this video is going to a place that I didn't want it to go to, but still, but I'm just going to talk about it. Like, um, a person who is getting paid per hour will always only have 24 hours. There's only 24 hours in a day. So if your income is met by the hour standard, like you cannot increase hours in a day. It's always going to be 24 hours. But if you're, if you find a way that you can make income like passively, like you're sleeping and you're making money is getting into your pocket, like find a play, find a means of, what is it? How do I say that? Means of work? That's, that's definitely not the statement, but just find work that you can be making money when you're not putting, uh, when you're not the equivalent, whoever is not ours, you know? I don't know how to explain that. <laughs> I hope you guys understood that. But, yeah, and the last thing is focus on yourself. I know this might sound selfish or whatever, but just focus on yourself and, like, try, I don't know how to say this. I've been saying I don't know how to say this a lot, right? But, yeah, just focus on yourself i think that's self-explanatory right so yeah those are all the habits that i'm going to be trying to implement in 2020 to achieve my goals i hope you guys can implement some of these habits so that you also can achieve your goals and if you guys do implement this habits please tell me and tell me how it works out for you and i might be sharing how it will work out for me so yeah that is it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you learned something i hope it was a little bit inspiring or whatever to like create make your goals if you haven't made them yet and yeah work towards them so that is it guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like comment share and comment down below what you guys want me to be doing next uh that's it for the video guys bye